Just a reminder, I am still gay as hell. Uh, <laughs> thank you, I'm great at it. I appreciate it. Um, yeah, I was just sitting there, uh, you know, one day just, you know, being black. And I was like, you know what? Give me another thing. <laughs> I got it, I can handle it. <laughs> but yeah, I, uh, I'm also uh, an immigrant uh, because I always want the news to be about me, you know? <laughs> I, um, my family came to America from Africa in 1985, back when I was just a, a little diva. And it was, all, it was also the first time I ever saw a white person. And my immediate thought was, it's a black ghost. That's what I mean. <laughs> Mother, be wary. This country's filled with apparitions. <laughs> but yes, I, uh, I'm a black. Gay immigrant, that's um, a lot of adjectives. Uh, it's, it's a lot to unpack, but to be honest, I don't feel unique. I believe there's way too much commonality amongst us that we don't recognize. Like I know for a fact that everyone here has an enemy list. <laughs> we all do. We all have at least one person. If they don't show up to the world tomorrow, we'll believe in God again. <laughs> I'm just like you. I'm no different. I have an enemy list. It's a very short, very concise list. The um, first person on this list is a gentleman that offered me a cookie. But then he had me a Fig Newton. <laughs> Those two things aren't comparable. <laughs> Close your eyes. Imagine a cookie. Is anyone here thinking of a nasty brick of fiber with gross ass <laughs> jelly in the middle? That's not a cookie. <laughs> the second person on this list is, um, is my friend's mother. <laughs> she would mix Nesquik with water. Oh. Y'all, that's mud. <laughs> that is nasty, sugary ass mud. <laughs> she even tried to convince us once that Crystal Light was Kool-Aid. I'm like, lady, you gotta go. Nick is an ass parrot. But the last person on this list is a very special person. Um, is anyone here a fan of the wonderful world of Harry Potter? I... I love Harry Potter. I love Harry Potter so much, I went all the way to Orlando, Florida, a butthole of a city, and... <laughs> I went to Universal Studios Florida to go to Harry Potter World. One of the best days of my life. I got, a, I got a wand, I wore a cloak, no one stopped me because I'm a grown ass man. <laughs> and I was having such a great day until I met this individual. Um, it was a Harry Potter World employee. Yeah. And he called me, he called me a muggle. <laughs> mm -hmm. To my entire face, yes. <laughs> Uh, for those of you who are not familiar, um, a muggle is a derogatory term for a non-magical person in the world of Harry Potter. <laughs> and I did not spend $150 to have a white teenager call me the N-word of the wizarding world. <laughs> I was only asking for directions to the bathroom. <laughs> and he responded with, well, sir, the muggle restroom is down the corridor. <laughs> and I replied, young man, you work in a theme park in Florida. Spell corridor. <laughs> Thank you guys so much.